Hello and welcome to my intro to Dash and Dot. Now I've just been sent these so this is a bit of an intro video uh, and I'm super excited about it so I'm trying to work out what to do with them. The apps are uh, for iOS and Android. Um, iOS I think is a little bit uh, further advanced than Android at the moment. Uh, there's four apps, Go, Path, Xylo and Blocky. Go is your intro app, Path is for following lines and doing certain routes, Blocky is for programming them and Xylo I think plays a musical instrument. Not really sure yet, as I said this is a bit of an intro video. Um, when I got these, I thought beautiful. The boxes are really nice. The the pa I mean the packaging's awesome. Uh, turned them on, and thought, oh, I wonder what they do. Okay. It's kind of like it's got its own little personality. As I said, this one's dash. It's got motors, so it's got wheels underneath. Uh, the head goes up and down and round and round. Uh, it's got a front light and I think it's got more sensors at the back. Free microphones, etc, etc. You can find out about them on their website. There's all the differences between them, capabilities, how they work. Um, different ages, how to control them from 5 to 8. 8 to 12, 12 plus. One I, the one I'm looking forward to is you're trying out the SDK. I'm an iOS developer slash Android developer, so that's what I'm interested in different hours I've got to be honest one of the things I instantly liked about this is they become rechargeable batteries because I'm fed up of putting batteries in things so fire these up and then I've got a little button at the back little one starts up aren't they cute already my son's had a play with them if you notice the side lights are different colors um, you can customize this color if you use the app if you use the app, let's go. Um, you can basically make and make noises. Let's search for the right robot. I've got two plugged in at the moment. So let's connect to Dash. Just hold it down there. I mean, this is sweet. It moves about, does little things, makes noises. You can get it to do other little things, move about. I mean, my son thought this was absolutely awesome. Uh, he's three and a half. Uh, I know the age range is five. Just to notice, you also get these things here. These go on the side to allow you to mount Lego things. So you've got Technic axle pins. Um, you've got bricks on the top. And like the bionicle joints can go, ball joints can go in there. So that's pretty useful. So the app, I've only used the first app, first of all, to move it about. You've got speed control there. Move it about. Whee! If you can see that. Woohoo! Warning, I'm trying out my Google Glass to do videos. Hopefully they're all right. Go on, sit there, dude. Right, you can control the head. Meow. I mean, obviously, the idea of this is for kids to program it. To, you know, it's got sensors at the front to detect how far it is from the wall and infrared sensors, etc. etc. So the actual website says it's got. Dashes, three microphones, one speaker, 12 white LEDs, RGB LED is spotlights, tail lights, four IR sensors, three distance sensors, and uh, two IRs to detect robot receivers. When it says robot receivers, it actually means dot. So obviously this is a cute little bot that can make noises, etc. And there's stories on the app to help you, you know, play with them and they tell stories and you do missions and stuff. But this can also become a controller for Dash. So I haven't done that yet, but one of the things you can do in the programming draggable drop, uh, drag and drop block program is move it all about and use this to control this, which is pretty cool. I mean, I just like the personality they got. You can kind of customize uh, the lights. So I've got orange flashing at the moment. They are green, pink, quite like the purple actually. You've also got the front light, and just look at that different changes of colour. Um, then you've got, I don't know what this bit does. Oh, this is different. Oh, look, there's sine wave. Oh, yeah, so that controls this bit here, how the lights flash. That's pretty cool. Um, 
And there's also the dimness of the light at the front. I mean, I mean, look at the software here. They've, they've done a good job on this. They've got ideas on things to do with it. Do, do, do. So different, different puzzles and ideas. And I, I, I really like this. Um, it just works. There's no problems. I have heard that the Android app is a little bit behind the iOS one. But, and I can review the Android one if anybody cares. Uh, and there might be a Windows one, not really sure yet. But anyway, uh, post any questions you would like to know about these. I hope to do a programming one next introduction of this. Oh, yeah, there's got little buttons on top. Ah. Um, and uh, there should be more videos coming soon. Thank you very much.